This week on fan service, we discussed. Oh. <laughs> we <forgot. laughs> this week on fan service, we discussed anime 180s. My first 3D experience. I'll explain a little about Future Diary. And process meats. Like, yeah, yeah, no, they did, yeah. they did they... a Squidward spinoff. It's when he goes to Squidville. I know. Oh, that's what I was going to say. There we go. Yeah. And I think that's all you need. <laughs> yeah. We got it. We already got you it. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> we got the spinoff. Yeah. The only, the only SpongeBob, like, new spinoff I would accept, anime SpongeBob. We've already got Ooh. the OPs for it. Yeah. They're all yeah. over YouTube. Yep. Yeah. And maybe that's our intro to the um, show. Yeah. <laughs> the anime SpongeBob. Anime that SpongeBob. What we're yeah. For? yeah. Yeah. Let's go ahead and start it. Sure. Welcome to fan service. <laughs> <laughs> Richard's official anime uh, podcast. Yeehaw. Yeah. That's it. Not, not anime uh, SpongeBob. Oh, but cool, if but only, should, if only, if though. only, if only, I'd I join. Am, uh, I'd be the president, president, of the SpongeBob, president Fiona, yeah, president SpongeBob, uh, the secret official ser- podcast. We're the Secret Bob. Service. <laughs> what would you call an uh, anime SpongeBob podcast? Uh, uh, SpongeBob, uh, Sp- uh, but you have to say it that way. <laughs> SpongeBob, <laughs> Nani. SpongeBob Nani. <laughs> uh, But I'd call myself Cole because I'm one oh, of the hosts okay. of this show. Oh, that, yeah. Hi, Cole. I'm Miles. I'm also a host on the show. Hi, I'm Isa. And I'm we here have- often. A very special guest with us. Very, very special guest. Yeah, the president of the SpongeBob. The president. <laughs> <laughs> Fiona, how's it going? Hey, what's up, Fiona? What's oh, up, guys? Hi. Yeah, uh, Fiona is like the biggest anime fan outside of the animation department. Yes, mm-hmm. I yeah, am. even like bigger than most people in the animation department. Oh. So Damn. we uh, mm. we ha- we knew we had to get her on. Actually, like somebody tweeted at us this week because uh, we're, we're going to talk about my hero. Um, oh, thank God, but. Uh, <laughs> Stop, yeah, shit. you tweeted about uh, Kaminari? No, no, Kir- Kirishima, Kirishima. Because Kirishima. The, the recent episode yes. came out. And uh, yes, I knew yeah. Kirishima was gonna get his lime, like his, yeah, his limelight. Light. Yeah. Have you read the manga? I I know bits and pieces of it. Okay, okay. but like I don't I don't want to read it because I kind of lose track sometimes. Yeah, yeah. It's like yeah. it's so it's a lot, and then I forget a week, and then I'm you know I forget no, that, months. Yeah. And then, that, there you go. <laughs> that, that just happened to me where I'm like, oh, I, I I didn't read the past weeks. I went back. I'm like twenty. We have, 20 weeks behind. Yeah, yeah. It, it oh, happened wait, so wait, fast. Wait, wait, wait. It was one week it behind. It happened so fast. And so. then now you have to catch up and you're like, what's going on? And then, yeah. But um, no, I just follow the anime for my hero, really. Like, nice. Nice week. Like that, yeah. Every Saturday but, morning. So yeah, so, premium. Yeah, you tweeted about it this weekend. <laughs> and uh, people were like, hey, you guys should get Fiona on fan service. I was like, well. <laughs> well, <laughs> funny. Funny. Fact, funny. We didn't funny already have that yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Nice. So, yeah. Welcome, so, yeah. welcome to the show. Thanks. Thanks for having me. Tell us about yourself, Fiona. Yes. What's ooh, you? What are you watching? I, uh, ooh, what I'm watching. Uh, finished Demon Slayer. Nice. <gasps> nice. Welcome, okay, cool, welcome, cool, cool. Welcome. Cool, cool, ESPN cool. So with the guest appearance. That was so <laughs> ESPN. Ooh, ooh. I love that. Nice. <laughs> I, episode, episode, I finished episode ten. I'm I'm slowly getting. Oh there. my god, yeah. dude. I mean, it was each episode was just like a. Ooh. Yeah. So good. Yeah. It was so good. I was talking recent just to get on Demon Slayer, but I was talking to Cole about this. Um. Uh, yesterday earlier yeah. today um where i was kind of just like you know i'm watching it and i'm into it right yeah. it's like oh shit like that's the one show for some reason all the episodes you are they go by so quickly and that's like mm-hmm. frightening yes, at how every episode goes sad. by so quickly and you're like okay well i want to watch the other one it's like i i get exhausted because of how fucked up it is not because of the mm-hmm. pacing of the show yeah um but then one of the conversations i was having with someone else i was just like well we're into the show we're at the same point why is it how is it that episode 19 changes everything what happens there that makes that turns the show because we're into it already but yeah. why is episode 19 special I'm, I'm gonna go i'm gonna go out on a limb and say like episode 19 was not a big a deal to me as it was to everybody ah! else if it's the episode that i think it is wait what yeah what yes what was earmuffs 19? real quick earmuffs real quick Ooh, oh right. is that, and is this that, will be a spoiler it, a quick yeah. spoiler Ooh. this is, is the it, is, uh, it when he, is it when he does the flame dance yeah, yeah I th- here's my thing okay you can come back you can okay, come back, you come back. I thought yeah, that was very know, cool that did not that was that, not a big change to me. I was like, oh, that's fucking tight. This, you also I, knew about it going in. Did I? Yeah, because we had talked about it beforehand. That was like, that was the episode, because I had kind of like taken a break. Like I was a few episodes behind, and then the internet blew up. Mm. About, I mean, it also has like the best animation of the it show. I mean, it yeah. absolutely does. Mm-hmm. I mean, it changed for me. I was, I watched, I was like, Phew. yeah. Like, the, I had to rewatch it because I was just like, it, that, I don't know what, I couldn't process I, it. It, yeah. it got me back into watching it. Uh-huh. And then I also read the manga and caught up after that. Because yeah. I remember everyone talking about episode 19. I think I was preparing for some sort of big sort of narrative thing or plot thing. Yeah. And, and I, I get it is a little bit, 
But it, to me, it was yeah. more of like a, it was more of a technical thing where I was like, oh fuck yeah, that's yeah. tight as shit. <laughs> to me, it, it also kind of plays not in the not in the same feeling, but it's also that's kind of where the show is kicking off. That's like the hey, the first big twist. It's like, yeah. hey, you mm. thought you knew what this show. No. Nope. You thought you knew what he was. Mm-hmm. Hmm. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. We'll I don't, see, I, don't yeah. wanna, I realize, like, I want to be very vague. Yeah. Not spoil. Yeah. It's good. So, it's good. Demon good. Slayer. Yeah. <laughs> I, had, I had tweeted, and it was like, Demon Slayer is hype, and all, like, in all caps. <laughs> and then, like, 30 minutes later, I was like, this show's too fucked up. I'm going to take a break. <laughs> <laughs> break. You also got to be careful. Sometimes. Demon Slayer's hype, and people are like, oh, don't you love it when this happens? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no one has said anything. Good. People are, people are well, kind. Be anyway. careful now. Thank now you, people yes. know that you're. Ooh. I know. Yeah, so watch was... your Twitter feed. I know. <laughs> so you finished Demon Slayer. Oh, yeah, Demon Slayer. Um, I tried. I started Doctor Stone. Oh, I had a hard time getting into it. Mm. I don't know why. I, how how I far think, in yeah. did you get? Two episodes. <laughs> <laughs> so, and I'll be like, if I'm not interested in it, I just no. That's yeah. yeah that's I valid. just don't that's really. Valid. That's watch something it. we. That's something we we'll have to talk about eventually. Like people often give like the three episode. Yeah. Where it's like, oh, you watch two or three episodes, and if you don't like it by then. That's completely fine. I say if you don't like it after one episode, you don't yeah, have to keep same. watching. Yeah, the same. Yeah, because it's um, well, it depends. Doctor yeah. Stone, I will say, it was crazy because when we've talked about it a little bit on the show before, uh, the manga switched main characters after the first like six chapters. Okay. <laughs> where you feel like it's the the lovers is yes. the main characters. Yeah. No, it's the uh, celery head. Huh. Thank you. It's they realized that <laughs> he was a bigger selling point for the manga. Yeah, for so sure. Wild. Yeah. And they flipped so it over. Wild. Um once you get after, out of that first arc, that's people who like Dr. Stone like that one. I apparently stopped watching the episode right before everything gets better. Oh, yeah. So oh, I, I, one of these days I'll go back and I'll try yeah. it again. That's also it's it should have been good from the beginning. Yeah. So yeah. you're gonna lose people if you're not yeah. good from the beginning. Yeah. I mean like I'm also watching Fire Force and like that first episode got me medium. So oh, like, nice. All right, I'm gonna I, watch it. I didn't like Fire Force first. I like yeah. it now. You like Ooh. it now? I like it now. So, like, from what episode was it that changed your opinion? <sighs> um, or like, So, my problem was all the way up through, like, episode five. Yeah. Because I didn't like the... I'm not the biggest fan of, like, the, um, what's it, Lucky Pervert? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and there's a character who is that, like, who is the definition, <laughs> textbook definition of that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, and I, and so, but I can also put that aside. I can also be like, sure. okay, well, that's... That's one Comic thing. relief. Yeah. That's not the story. That's... Right. It, it does invade the story sometimes, yes. but I can put it aside. What I had trouble with was when newbie characters were on par with seasoned professionals. Oh. Okay. And there was no like reason. Valid. It's like, yeah. oh, you are just new to this fire force. Like you're just new to this team. Why are you able to take on this other division who seems like they've been together for mm-hmm. years and all of a sudden a full on squad on squad battle where they have more people who are seasoned veterans. You newbies are able to come in and take it. Yeah. It's Question. Just, yeah. As, as someone that hasn't watched Fire Force, are you telling me that there's competitive firefighting in this universe? <laughs> um, Is so that what's I happening? Mean, so, oh, yeah. We don't, I don't know not too far off. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> okay. actually, actually, yeah, they're, okay. they're like, this is a training. Because essentially, oh, Fire Force is okay. very. Did you ever watch uh, <laughs> Premiere? No, I haven't watched Premiere. Okay. So, uh, it's kind of. Well, not really. Uh, yes. People are spontaneously combusting, and that's like a thing that happens in, on Earth now. To be fair, to the point that you just made, that is like that's a similarity that uh, is not like common. Yeah. <laughs> like, you have two stories that are about people exploding and spontaneously yeah. combusting. So, yeah, I think it's fair to these, say that they're similar. And so the fire department, the fire forces, are groups of people who use fire magic, of course. like psychic it's like, fire, it's like, yeah. to yeah. fight yeah. against. Are you wait? The f- people who are spontaneously combusting because they turn into like demons. Cole. Yeah. All right. Can you tell me right now these motherfuckers are fighting fire with fire? Yeah. A hundred percent. Sometimes. Sometimes 100%. ice. Sometimes. So, sometimes. Yeah. A big shield. <laughs> yeah. He just wants to know about the fire. I just wanted that fire one. Fire I just need that one. Yeah. Okay. 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 It was essentially because I really wanted to like uh, Sakura Hibana. Mm-hmm. I'm like, oh, oh, I was like, yes. she's very good. Mm. Uh, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> that was like they like. Very early, I'm just like, oh yeah, this is easy. Like, and then after they started introducing, oh, here are challenges, and you're gonna have to use like your your brain. There's also a character who I didn't understand at first. Uh, one of my roommates put it as he's a character who took all of when leveling up, took all of his points out of intellect and put it in strength. Mm. <laughs> and so the yeah. first fight you like, one yeah. of the first fights you see, he's losing very badly, and then he realizes that he's uh, right-handed. And then he wins the fight. 
That's like, Ooh. that's like Deku that's forgot he had legs yeah. times yeah. 10. Yeah. <laughs> I was actually going to compare. I was like, if you don't like the fact that uh, the main, the pro- protagonist so like OP compared yeah. to like seasoned professionals, yeah. do, you, do you care about that when it comes to Deku? Because I feel like Deku does have that advantage. Uh, but Deku, Deku, see, I trust it with Deku because he I'll learned, fly. like Deku's like strength always was his knowledge and that yeah. he researched how to, like, so like, mm. Deku still also kind of he loses. He like, does, yeah. He loses all the time in the first season, and even the second season. Actually, he loses pretty much like he the loses first two a lot. Seasons, the yeah. first two seasons, he loses every time. Well, Other yeah. people come and save him. The fact when he actually starts winning is a major plot point. Like mm-hmm. Bakugo's like, "Who the fuck did you yeah, become, yeah. and how?" Like yeah. they make a point uh-huh. to like comment on that through other characters. But which even I think then, is like really the school well tournament arc, he loses mm-hmm. against Stain. He technically loses, like. Mm-hmm. Mm, mm. It's all the way. He keeps losing, losing, losing. He keep, yeah, yeah, he does keep on losing. Before we get too far away from it, you know, mentioning something earlier about like you, you give a episode, you know, you've show this many episodes, and then like you'll either give up or like maybe you'll it'll you know you'll change your tune on it. What is a show that you have done, a show or a character that you've made the biggest one eighty on? As about like maybe you start off absolutely hating the show, and then it gets to a certain moment. Fucking Monogatari. Akamonogatari? Yes. That's the vampire one that you showed me, right? Yes. I still only, was I that, is that the movies or is that the I series? I showed you the right? movies. Because we watched the first two movies. I yes. still need to see the, the third movie. one. Yeah. The series, um, it was at a point in time where I wasn't ready for that directing style. Well, what is uh, Bakamonogatari for those that don't know? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> one sentence. I don't want to, I don't, I don't want to trigger a Cole explains here. <laughs> but so the best way I can put it is, it is a supernatural drama mm-hmm. where a guy is helping people he interacts with with supernatural phenomena that are affecting them. Okay. Okay. So, like, the f- the first character, like, first two episodes is he's dealing with a girl who uh, is weightless. Like, mm-hmm. she has to stick uh, school supplies in her skirt to keep herself weighed down on the ground. That's Otherwise, she'll hysterical. fly away. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's great. Okay. Um... So you just weren't a fan of it at first. And I remember you showed me the films, and they do have a very unique directing style. They do, yes. yes. Mm-hmm. He uh, does a lot of interesting things. It's just a really unique form of directing. Yeah. Um, and so, like, the first time I watched it, I was like, I can't really process this. Like, do I need to pause every time? Because they do a lot of things where, like, when scene changes, they'll flip to a black panel, and it'll say, like, black. And then it'll flip to something else, and they'll be, like, um, almost, like, subconscious messaging mm-hmm. uh-huh. where just flashes a bunch of words at you super quickly oh, and yeah. if you can read Japanese you're supposed to be able to understand so like do I need to pause and read but that's also defeating the purpose of it being subconscious yeah I would almost liken it to and this is not a great one for one comparison but kind of the later episodes of Evangelion mm-hmm. in the way that they're just kind of throwing some imagery at yeah, you yeah. in really yes. quick succession except rather than imagery it's uh, kanji it's uh, it, yeah. 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 So, yeah and yeah it's like it, it can be a as lot. well as like different colors, like the different colors mean different things. Like every time there's red, there's supposed to be like blood somewhere. Mm. Every time it's black, it's when somebody closes their eyes and like, but it's all significant. It's like, really weird. Yeah. I, I dug it, but I also watched it later into my anime life. Okay. Yes. <laughs> anime life. So it took a while for me to come back around onto it. Mm. Uh, another one was Attack on Titan. I hated Attack on Titan the first mm, episode. Yeah. Mm. I was like, I don't want to see these big, ugly dudes running around. <laughs> I don't want that. Yeah. <laughs> well, oh, yeah, let's, let's... I mean, well, yeah. Uh, Attack on Titan, I liked, I loved it like from the first episode, so that's a bad example. But I think um, I had a hard time, Full Metal Alchemist. Mm. Just, we, yeah, weird, but like the first couple episodes, or like maybe just the yeah. The story, like if someone were to explain it to me, I was just not. I was like, I don't not really care to watch yeah. it. Like it's whatever. But I mean, I fucking, I yeah. well, I binged that shit in like a day. Yeah, yeah. I, and I, I was like, it was yeah. super good. I think it was kind of in the same boat because not too long ago, I wanted to re rewatch Brotherhood. Yeah, and like, I, I think. And there's always a like, which one's better? The OG. I think they're different. I don't mm-hmm. know I if one is. I honestly, think probably I'd say like technically speaking, I think Brotherhood's. Better. I would wager to say you should actually watch both. I think you should. I definitely think you should watch the original before you watch Brotherhood because yes. I think Brotherhood respects your time more. Yeah. <laughs> um, um, but I, either either way, well, I, I I started I started rewatching Brotherhood. and I also tried kind of rewatching the first one. And the, in both the first few episodes, I was like, I yeah. don't want to be here. So, I want to yeah, be where yeah, I know yeah, this is yeah, going. Yeah. I, it's hard for yeah. me to rewatch that I agree, series because yeah. I, I knew at a point it was going to get really good. Yeah, it's just like that yeah. time to get there. 
Yeah. I don't know. It was it was hard for me to get into it at first, but then when I when I was in it, I was like, oh, yeah. It's kind of like oh, when man. it was kind of like when they're all like, hey, Death Stranding gets great after ten hours. Yeah, and it's like, yeah. Mm, do I really want to do all that? It's not. That's it's not. Yeah. Full Metal Alchemist is not that bad. Full yeah. Metal Alchemist is great. No, I actually with Full Metal Alchemist, I would actually say there's like a true watch watching way where it's you watch. I don't know. <laughs> you watch up until the phone booth. Mm-hmm. Oh. Of the of the original series. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Then at that point you switch over to Brotherhood. Whoa! <laughs> Interesting. For, oh, Brotherhood ooh. episode one or Brotherhood um, from, from, from the phone booth. From, from the phone booth. Interesting. Because yeah. I think it does a better job with Shaw Tucker. Up, yeah. Have you done that? Have you watched it like that? It it, it totally works. Uh, no, but I should. I should. <laughs> oh, dude, leave in the comments if that yeah. works. Like, if that you've watched it that because way, I think yeah. it does, that's it, super interesting. It does a better job of building up Mayhews. It does a better job mm-hmm. of building up uh Shaw Tucker because like. I mean, when you see Brotherhood, you know Shaw Tucker is bad from the beginning. Yeah. yeah. When there, you watch the original series. Yeah, there is like a difference oh. in time too because, um, what is it? It's definitely clear Brotherhood, they only spend a certain amount of time repeating what happens. Right. They were like, we've Just, done this they, before. Yeah, we've done which, this before. to their credit, it's like, they know their fucking audience here. Yeah, yeah like, exactly. Which I think was really smart of yeah. them to do. Yeah. Totally. Um, but I think Cole is correct in that, like the way that the first one did it, pretty good. Because mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. was when they still had manga reference. Yeah. Right. And then so like they, they did take around time after that is where they lost the manga reference and they yeah. were like, well, let's and they had a great story on their own. I, yeah. I will still say I think though I think I probably prefer Brotherhood. I find the explanation for alchemy in the original series infinitely more interesting. Mm-hmm. I think that is such a cool concept as to like how alchemy yeah. works in a multidimensional universe yeah, yeah, scope. Yeah. Thought that shit was fucking chef's yeah. kiss. Mm. Love that. Love Issa, that. what's your 180? Uh, Show or Evangelion. Character. Evangelion. One hundred. Mm-hmm. Oh, I I don't know. What, I did... You went from hating it to liking it, or liking yeah. it to hating it. No, okay. you hating to love. I don't know if I. I feel like I mentioned this before, or once. Um, I I tell this story often. Um, I shit on Evangelion <laughs> for episodes one to sixteen. Like we were marathoning it, and um, all I did was just like talk shit. For yeah, straight. You know, it's just like Shinji's a piece of shit. I fucking hate Oscar. Yeah. What is Ray's the only good person in this entire group? <laughs> like, why are people so shitty in this entire show? Um, and then sixteen happens, and I that is like, like that is the term they actually use is like the mind rape episode. Mm-hmm. And oh my fucking god, I was silent for the rest of the yeah. series, other than me crying. Like, yeah, 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 but, other, yeah other than Silent that. crying. Yeah, <laughs> silent crying. And then like when the show would stop, it's like, it's like okay, stop, yeah. stop. Um, But yeah, that was, that was the most interesting time, or the one I remember the most where I remember just shutting up, just being like, oh, I was wrong. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, oh, I man, really, because yeah. I watched Ava much later. Yes. Like, I watched it when it came on Netflix. That was the first time I saw it. I didn't want to like it. I was like, okay, mm. this has been like a gatekeeper show for so long. Mm. People have been like, you're not a real anime fan unless you watched Ava. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, <laughs> I watch, I like, I like the anime. Yeah. yeah. I've never I, watched it either. And I was like, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah so I was watched- like, I was like, oh, I don't like, I don't know. It, it seems old. Yeah. I've watched other old stuff that's like, okay, it's good. And it was good for the time. Ava was like, Good for now. Mm. If they yeah. if they like re- they made this oh, like God, now. Yeah. today yeah. and release that now, it would still Rebuild. be amazing. <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah. Well, that exact thing, like that exact. I'm still need to watch all the rebuilds. I think it's been Same. long enough. Yeah, it, so. I I think there's something to be said about like why Eva is such a classic, um, because I think there's so many base ideas in Eva that just like it still works. Mm-hmm. I just yeah. I don't. It's, it's, it's hard to per, like perfect execution. Yeah. With yeah, all of their like crazy. allegories and metaphors and yeah, yeah, visually and just how they built it. Uh, <laughs> uh! There's, just, there's just so much though. Like I get overwhelmed when anyone says like, "Oh, even Galleon, watch this, then watch this." Oh yeah. Watch- so yeah. like, is it just a series? There's like three series already on Netflix, and it's all like different names. So right? it's, oh, oh yeah. So, so it's like, where do you start? Watch, watch the <laughs> Evangelion series, yes. and then end of Evangelion. I would put some time between those viewing yeah. experiences. Okay. I yeah. really, really would. Yeah. Because um, Death and Rebirth are just recaps recap of the movies. series. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's a clip show. Okay. Much. Yeah. yeah. Probably not. I very much enjoyed the series, and I thought the film was interesting. Okay. Uh, it's kind of where it came for me. But, yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, I also have my onions. Hit me with your onions. Oh, I, 
we may have talked about this. I prefer the series. I'm one of the people who like prefer the series. And Carrie and I will argue about this. I prefer the series over the rebuild. And okay. I prefer the series over the movies. And the rebuild's just the clip show, right? Well, no. 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 They, I was about to say, the, re- so, okay. the rebuild is also slightly different. It's different. Like, structurally, right? So, yeah, so the, like, those are the ones that are on Netflix. The, okay, yeah. Uh, original series. Original series. Original, and then okay. a different studio, the, the spiritual successor studio to uh, Gainax, Studio Kara, made the rebuilds. Okay. And the first one is pretty much just a retelling. The first one's practically a retelling. It's a remake. Yeah. Okay. The second okay. one like is where it differentiates. It yes. starts yes. to split off. And the third one is completely different story than what happened mm, in the yeah. It feels almost like a more of like a fun what if. Okay. You know, of like what if what if things were slightly what if different? Did, what if okay. let's go we all know the story. Let's see if we attacked it from a different okay. way and yeah. there were some different ingredients in this oh, mix. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. I understand what you mean though with like I cuz Eva does have that high barrier. Mm. Yeah, tree. I mean mm. I was I was always confused about it cuz it's yeah. just like there's so much happening with it. Yeah. So it's like I don't even know where to start. So yeah. why should I? <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, so I, was like, I understand what you mean. Yeah. If mm. you ever get the chance to watch the series. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. If, if it's the series if that like. I have to start with and yeah. I will. Yeah. Yeah, but it it is I think it is uh, as cool as like well, it's still very, yeah, still very yeah. Uh, much a thing. Mm-hmm. Um, but I do prefer the series over any of the other movies that they have made. Okay, um, good to know. Yeah, if only because I like the message at the end. Yeah, yeah, it yeah. it ends a bit more hopeful for me as opposed hopeful. to yeah, as, uh, as, as opposed, opposed to, to like, some of the other shit that some they of the other pulled. content out there. Yeah, uh, Tokyo Ghoul. <laughs> oh. <laughs> First season of Tokyo Ghoul. Like, I I, I've never it. seen Tokyo Ghoul. <laughs> yeah, me too. I, I hate things when they're so depressing. There's like yeah. no, oh, no yeah. light of hope. There's I, absolutely zero. And it's like, that's not how life works. Like, ob- obviously bad shit happens. But yeah. something good eventually happens. Like, something yeah. bounces. Yeah, and I'm it's like, not, yeah, it's it like, doesn't just... Like it's just a slap on it his can't. face like you can't. constantly. And also, like, your fiction, you get to make it happy. Yeah, yeah. You get to write a happy get, ending. Yeah, it's like, I can't. I don't want to watch some kid be depressed because yeah. of this. Depressed and tortured and like. I don't want to. For no reason. Yeah. Um, it's like, wait, no. are we talking about Evangelion or Tokyo Ghoul? Tokyo Ghoul. Tokyo Ghoul. That's the Does end. Does it matter? Points and laughs. I don't see the difference. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's why I can't watch Black Mirror. Oh yeah, yeah. I yeah. can't watch yeah. Black Mirror. I get that. Have you watched Darker Than Black? Have you? Seen <gasps> that? Oh yes. You well, guys I've... have watched it. Yes. I haven't yeah. watched that since college. Okay. I barely remember that. It's I just been remember a being minute, like, though. Yeah. Lightning yeah. Batman yeah. was yeah. like what I kind yeah. of. Rem- I don't. And like he strings, was in, right? Yeah, and he was like into the like he was he was Kudo or Black, and then there was the other members of his team, right? It was, was like girl. Silver, yeah, yeah like yeah. in or something. Yeah. Um, oh man, this is a throwback. Yeah, yeah. it's what been because oh. I uh. also watched it in college, and for some reason in my brain, I cannot. I always mix up Tokyo Ghoul and Darker Than Black. Mm. Huh. They seem um, like color palettes. Like, I think so. I think feel dreary, maybe, raining yeah. all the time. I think sadness, with Tokyo crying. Ghoul, there's also a scene where they're on a rooftop, and the it's one like thing the I exact, remember yeah. from Dark yep. in the Black is always rooftops. Yeah. It's always the rooftop. That's where you got to use your dagger knife. Now, yeah. I'm Darker thing. Than Black was very early in my anime life, <laughs> and I remember thinking like. What a fucking anime ass title. <laughs> <laughs> we must go darker well, than that. And then what? I met Cole and was like, oh, there's shows called like My Sister is a Teenage Dungeon and I think I like her, but she's also a demon yeah, seven like, question marks. And I was yeah. like, oh no, oh, that's no. an anime title. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Anyway, darker that, that's a throwback. Yeah. Darker <laughs> than <laughs> fucking black. I'm wow. seeing that's the actual title. That was a really fun thing. The, the first time I got to go to <laughs> yeah. the first thing yeah. I got to, time I got to go to Japan um, for Ruby Volume Three stuff, we had dinner with a lot of um, the folks there from uh, WBJ and um, Viz? a few. Uh, no, Viz, I don't think Viz was there, um, but there were a few other folks from a few different um, studios, and we had uh, we had dinner that night. And because we were like the foreign guests, like I remember our uh takaya san was like hey it would be really cool i know you guys probably feel more comfortable together but like if y'all actually sat at different tables because everybody here wants to talk to you guys because yeah, y'all yeah. are the fucking white boys yeah, yeah. and i was like okay yeah, sure yeah, yeah, yeah. and what my <laughs> table turned into like you know gray's probably like he's talking like business stuff yeah. and like carrie's talking like animation stuff my table was like what's your favorite show <laughs> and we discovered this really fun thing where i was like i can't remember what i was watching at the time um but for oh oh uh, I was talking about uh the devil is a part timer is yeah. my favorite it's like my new favorite yeah. comedy anime and they're like devil is... what is that and I was like 
uh, and then I pulled up a picture of it, and they're like, oh, it's like the Japanese Sa- Satan name. is the Lord of McDonald's. Yes. Yes. Oh, that movie. And that's then we so, we played this game where so we started accurate, yeah. trying to be like, okay, what's oh, your favorite man. show? And that would be like this. And then you'd go, okay, what could that possibly yeah, yeah, be? Yeah, yeah, and then yeah. we would try, like, it was so much fun. That's it was so funny. much fun. Yeah, like the, like the American titles are just different versions mm-hmm. of yeah. the Japanese yeah. And you have a fun drinking game. Like, yeah, guess. Oh. Whoever, whoever it's like, uh, yeah, guess. Boruto's dad. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wait, oh my god, I want to play that. So, wait, hold on. Actually, uh what is what is the actual translation of Kimetsu no Yaiba then? What's that? Demon, Demon Slayer. Slayer. Uh, that's the actual Japanese title, Kimetsu no Yaiba. Oh, that's right. Like when people are like Boku no Hero and I'm like, I just call it my hero. Yeah, I, I, hero. I fucking yeah, yeah. own it. Yeah. yeah. I fucking yeah. Own, it. Yeah. own it. I'm not that that uh, level. Get up, Coley. I'm not going to be like, "Oh, you mean Boku no?" I'm just like, "Shut the fuck up." <laughs> Do you mean right. Boku no? <laughs> my, mm. su- uh, be be chaotic. Be like, "You mean uh, my Boku no Macademia?" <laughs> Boku no Macademia. <laughs> I would hate that. <laughs> so, oh, no. so at a uh, cursory Google search, oh, no. it was Annihilation Blade, Blade of Annihilation. Ooh. Okay, okay, cool. Well, isn't that also like Attack on Titan, the Shingeki no Kyojin? Yeah, does that's that right, not, yeah. Does that mean something else as well, or maybe I'm? It means like confused. Advance on Titan. So, uh, yeah, it might. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah. The, the no is usually possessive or of. Interesting. Yeah, so, yeah. They say the Yaiba a lot in the show, and I'm like, oh, it, it, it means blade, blade or sword yeah. Oh, yeah. in the show. Okay. So I'm like, oh, but it's not Demon Slayer. It's not, yeah. no. Huh. no, no. They had to switch it up. Have you watched all like all the almost all the anime on Netflix, or are you just no, no? <laughs> There's, <laughs> There's a lot. Some, at this point. There is a lot. There's so many, but it's like some of it is just like. Eh. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. Netflix, mm. I like it, but it's also like not what I want to watch. It. They have a lot of like kitty stuff. Like they yeah. have like yeah. Pretty Cure and yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. Well, I mean, I know I, Pretty Cure has a huge male fan base. That's basically like the bronies uh, on that. Oh, side. really? Oh, yeah. yeah. Sure Interesting. So Pretty Cure is a magical girl show. Okay. It has bomb ass anime. It's like Sailor though. Moon. Yeah. Okay. It's like Sailor oh, Moon, but that. has bomb ass anime. Okay. Okay. It looks really good. Like the it, you know, that term Sakuga, I guess, of like really mm-hmm. really mm-hmm. cool um, high animation, high budget. Um, whatever the term has become but it's basically right. very good animation good. Okay. you a lot of it actually comes from the pretty cure series wow yeah it's wow nuts. i feel like the only anime i watched on netflix was ajin oh. which was on netflix like two years ago yeah or that's yeah, right 3D. i think I, that, and i don't care for three like it's yeah. like it's like hard because um like an anime you see you always see 2d yeah, yeah. and then all of a sudden it's 3d it's like oh that's a change. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I would, but yeah. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, no, no. But it was just like I would see it, and I'm like, okay, this is all right. Yeah, yeah. 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 I'm into this it. Good. Yeah. Did you check out uh, Land of the Lustrous? Yes. That, that is one great. that I think yeah. takes great advantage yeah. of the yes. fact that yeah. it is a 3D medium. And I and I love that now. Like yeah. it's like 3D is like now I think maybe one of my favorites. Like at any time. Yeah. yeah. I'm just like they utilize it super well yeah. in they... Demon Slayer too. And I'm oh, seeing yes. I'm seeing more and more Ufo and more tables. shows that's like <laughs> they use it so intelligently. Yeah. There's so many. Every time we, um, when I'm watching um, Demon Slayer, whenever there's a 3D shot, we always go 3D. Yeah, 3D. Me too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's like, and we're always like, oh, hey, good 3D. Yeah. <laughs> like every time, we don't ever stop. And yeah. but it's it like you said, it's very smart the way they use it because yeah. it's always just for walking shots or like wide yeah. shots. And it's, it's like, like we don't need to fucking worry about. Yeah, this. it's like oh, what a good use of your fucking time. Yeah. yeah. I saw I saw the worst 3D. I was at a was it Berserk? Was, no, mm. Yes, that's bad too. <laughs> that's really bad. But mm. it was um, Zombie Land Saga. Oh, I love it so much, but the 3D so, 3D so bad. bad. Oh no, the 3D so bad. Like, why? Just the animated. Yeah. yeah, that's the idle one, right? Yes, yes. it's oh, so no. good. It's so yeah. bad. It happens at parts, and I'm like, I literally have to turn this off. Oh, I cannot watch. It. On the, uh, while we're on the topic too, did you guys see that Zombie yes. Land Two is doing a crossover with Zombie Land Saga? Saga? No, what does that yes. mean? I don't fucking know. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. It's like when when Splatoon did the Squid Girl crossover. Stop. I was like, yeah. Yes! <laughs> anyway, I don't really Except give a shit about Zombie like, Land 2, so. Yeah. There's, yeah. That was like, how does that work? Oh, it no. made me Weird. care about Zombie Land 2. <laughs> like, that's maybe, a nice, good one. That's like, what made you the Zombie Land saga. Yeah, made you. I was like, yeah. oh. I love that. All these girls and this very good boy. <laughs> <laughs> that that uh, manager is the funniest. Oh, oh yeah, that's so, right. He's fucking funny. Yeah, I need that's to watch right. the show. The um, 3D is bad though. Like, yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm okay. just prep, letting you know. Myself. So like fun, pretty fun fact, there was I was uh one of the times I was in LA and Raina Scully was still in LA. Mm-hmm. Um mm-hmm. I spent like a whole day with her and we actually talked about that. About yeah. I was just like, oh yeah, the like 3D versus 2D. We were talking about some like um uh, misconceptions that we were really frustrated about when it came to like 
um, what people had said before. And one of the things she mentioned was like there once again, the this term barrier of entry. Yeah. She's like, but a 3D uh, it's 2D is actually so much more accessible globally mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. because when it's 3D, it's that barrier of entry where people automatically look for that weird, like, uncanny valley. Right. Yeah. You're just looking for all the, like, yeah. you you automatically see all the bad stuff instead of what works. And, yeah. yeah, and I feel like it's because, like, in Demon Slayer, they do it so well because they transition yeah. perfectly into it. Mm-hmm. Whereas, like, and Ajin did it because it's, like, the entire thing's 3D. Yeah. yeah. Like, there's, like no, there's no, there's no like, switch switching. Yeah. It's just, that's all 3D. So your eyes just get used to it yeah. Yeah. at a point. But when it's, like, Zombieland Saga, for example, it's just... Okay, cut like literally the frame after it's all oh, 3D for another no. three yeah. minutes. It's like... I mean, it's like 2D. 2D, you're getting you're like getting less visual information than you are from like 3D. And mm. so if if you set this constant of like this is the amount of information yeah. you're getting, and your brain is having to fill in the gaps wherever else, and then suddenly you like, increase that intake yeah, of visual yeah. stimulus and information, and then take it away yeah. again, it's like that it's shit too much. It's stands too much. out. Yeah, yeah. It's, mm. it makes it bad. Yeah. That's, That's interesting. Yeah. But like. Yeah, because like Zombieland Saga, they'll cut in. They'll literally oh, the no! next frame, and it'll be for a minute, like a couple minutes too. It won't oh. just be like a second or like you know yeah. five seconds. Weird. It's just literally. I, I think that's all budget based. What, what kind yeah. of shots are they are they using for dance? It's them oh, yeah. dancing, oh. like running around, yeah. dancing on stage, and then it'll cut into like them like doing the the exact move. Then it'll pop back out to like the wide shot of them yeah. all moving yeah. around. It's wide two D inserts three D wide three D wide three D and two two D two D. Yeah. Whoa. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Love uh, Live does that a lot too. Yeah. Love Only their Love Live. Only their models. And 3D only is probably better. Only Idol Master does all 2D. It's like it's like yeah, it's like watching it on like on a mobile game or like if you're mm-hmm. watching a game. Yeah, it's yeah. like these 3D models like dancing and stuff, and then all of a sudden, yeah, it's anime. Because they want to get, the, they wanna get <laughs> in the close-ups, they want to get the facial detail. I see. And yeah. stuff, and when it's like, oh, when it's all wide, we can almost Save do money. mocap. Like, yeah. I, I remember the first anime with 3D that popped out to me was Back Mongolian Chop Squad. Oh yeah, that's they'll right. do they'll do the guitar shots really close up. Like it's like, bam, we're in 3D land. Yeah. Check out this sick riff. And I'm like, I don't need to. I don't. I don't want to. <laughs> My, put it the back, first, please. The first 3D I saw was in the Inuyasha ending, oh, where it's just God. a 3D mountain that it spins around, and it's oh. same every time we get there, we go 3D. <laughs> God, that's the funniest answer to yeah. your first 3D thing. Yeah. Wow, that's hilarious. Kagome! K- Kagome! Oh I need to watch that again. Any, people you, shouting Inuyasha and Kagome will forever be more like closer to my heart than people shouting uh, Kanada and Tetsuya. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Tetsuya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm like, no, it's all about Inuyasha and Kagome. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Except man. no one gets squished. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh man, I feel like that, that could be like, okay, boomer, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Boomer you're an anime boomer, Miles. <laughs> you're a millennial. You're, you're, you, no, you're anime boomers Inuyasha. are there for Akira. Millenn- yeah, anime exactly. millennials yeah. are there for Inuyasha. Yeah, exactly. You're a millennial, Miles. Yeah. No respect. No, res- <laughs> no respect. Avocados. Avocados. I don't remember what the fucking meme is anymore. Is, is millennial good or bad now? Who gives Who a knows? shit? We've come full circle. Yeah. We all just hate we're each other. All that's yeah. that's yeah. all we've established. Yeah, we're just all <laughs> shitty people. Let's <laughs> <laughs> see. What, what else have you been watching? Um, let's see. So my hero, uh, I watched and really, I really like the promised Neverland. Oh, hey. and I, yeah, I watched oh, it God. and it's, Ooh, you should. I, that's, I keep thinking, cause it's I'm, a... I'm just now getting caught up on recreators mm-hmm. cause oh. I put that off for way too fucking long. And I, ca- I just got to the point where I realized, oh, this is sheer Bako, but with metaphors. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> have you heard of recreators? No. So it is. A show about like about uh, characters from video games, manga, music videos, stuff, oh. anime come into the real world. Oh, and they're like, what's all it called? Recreators. 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 It's yeah, on it's like Amazon a- Prime Video, which is why I feel like it hasn't gotten a ton of traction. Yeah. And they're all. It was part of like their anime good? strike. It is. It it's is. very good. good. It is very quickly becoming one of my favorite anime I've ever seen. It's yes. ultimately wow. about the relationship of. Each of the, each side being equal, a creator, their creation, and their audience, uh-huh. yes. and how each of them belong to themselves and each other. Huh. Yes. Wow. Uh, Philosophical. Yes. Right? Yes. I cried twice so far. Oh, yeah. The the uh, crying will continue. Yes. Oh, I man. think if you're like a person who makes stuff, yeah, it's a very much a very it's a very oh poignant like yeah. anime. Oh God, yeah. Have you gotten to that uh, recap? Yes, the recap was very cool. Yeah, I enjoyed so the recap. It's, it's there's the best. Re- a, there's a moment. There was a moment in one episode that just made me laugh. Where they're trying, 
they are searching for something and they are searching for that thing through the means that they have to themselves as like creators mm-hmm. of content. And at some point someone's like, we need to stop thinking like creators and need to start thinking like the, the audience. audience and fans because yeah. there's fan sites and OCs mm-hmm. and things like that. And there's a line in there where it's like, yeah, it's hard to forget that fans and creators think very differently from time to time. And I'm sitting here like, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're, we're, no currently, shit. we're currently we're currently uh, watching a Ruby fandom that is dead set on something happening this volume that definitely isn't happening this volume. And we're going, why do they think this is going to happen? Is this it volume? Forrest coming back? No, it's a, <laughs> everyone's like, I can't wait for the shopping montage. And I'm like, why are people what? waiting for a shopping montage? We had the episode because, you know, all the Ruby characters have new outfits and stuff. Yeah, we had the episode where they got new outfits and stuff. And it's like, well, I still think we're going to get a shopping oh, montage. Like, and I'm like, for wait, for what? what? Wait, this is breaking I don't first, time, first time ever fan service breaking news. No, no, there's no, no shopping montage. No shopping montage so in no. Ruby. I literally had a talk with Eddie and Kay about how I shouldn't bring this up on Twitter, and instead I brought it up on a fucking talk show, yeah. <laughs> which is probably worse. <laughs> but it's, it, well, it's interesting though, because like you know, you'll get. I don't know if it's if there's no way it's just Ruby, but like there's a dangerous thing that happens when people have enough time to speculate and form their own opinions, and then they get locked on to the idea that community has had mm-hmm. and they really like that and then when the show doesn't do that people get really upset yeah and it's like I mean, that was a thing that's we're just like there's not gonna be a fucking shopping montage yeah. you guys i'm sorry I feel like we, that happens it's not a thing a lot, there's yeah. a lot more stuff that needs to happen in this volume to make time for a fucking shopping montage i'm sorry <laughs> anyways well, and i can't i can't even imagine like how that happens with y'all where it's all improv oh yeah oh yeah and people well, are like well i expected this to have yeah, like, it's like we literally do shit to it like on the fly. It's just like yeah. if it happens, yeah. it happens. Yeah. A, there is no script. Well, we just that's the thing. Like people want like that Uno the movie too. Yeah. Oh, when yeah. that first movie was like super improv and super yeah. like random. It was yeah. a mistake, basically. Most yeah. people and, pro- by the way, real quick, audience, Fiona does let's play yeah, stuff with I Achievement do, Hunter. Do, if yeah. you're not Hunter, familiar yeah, with, with her that. content. Yeah. Um, Achievement Hunter, yeah. Look him up. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They, yeah. Uh, no one knows who they are. I'm sure our audience <laughs> definitely hasn't heard of Achievement Hunter. <laughs> yeah. Anime Achievement Hunter. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if yeah. anime yeah. Achievement Hunter fans are allowed. I don't know. Oh no. Um but uh yeah, no, so like things like happen and it just happens and you can't really do it yeah yeah, yeah. it's just if it happens it happens you know and it's like well i would have done this it's like okay cool okay cool yeah well <laughs> come, in, come in why don't you come yeah. in and you do and it, you do <laughs> it yeah. Then. Yeah. Yeah. yeah no but I, I feel like i've seen that a lot in, in like fandoms where it's just like people want this specific thing and it's like the creators are looking at a bigger picture mm-hmm. thing yeah. like and they're looking at oh this will happen because this will happen and the guy's like I want them to kiss. Yeah. God, I want yes, them to kiss. I want them to but kiss. that's also the thing that if, you, if they never kiss, wanna, then the yeah. audience is like, okay, well, yeah, why like, will I trust you? Yeah, you, yeah. I can't trust you. There yeah, should be one kiss a season. <laughs> I want, I want them to kiss. <laughs> Looks at like him. <laughs> but anyways, Promise Neverland. Yes. Another oh, show right, I desperately yeah. need to watch. Did you? Promise Neverland. Is it done? Sure. Or um, the season? No, the season's done, okay. but I did. I started reading the manga. But oh. it's they really just crazy. announced the second Yeah, season. they did, yeah. Okay, okay, How many okay. episodes for season? 12. 12. Where do you find it? Find uh, it? Foin? <laughs> find it? Uh, you find it? I watch it on Crunchyroll. Crunchy. Oh, yes. Crunchyroll. Yeah, I, mean, I think Crunchy Funimation Roll. has a dub, probably. Yeah. But that's an, that's an easy, like, binge yeah. Oh, yeah, like quick. Yeah. That's one that will go by too quick. I... That's one that you will like. Okay. You'll watch it be like, oh, what? Yeah, maybe I'll hit that next. Maybe I'll yeah. hit that after recreator. You I, will so, like it. So, like, I mean, legitimately, I watched the first episode because I, Aaron suggested it to me. And I was like, okay, that's cool. But then as I was watching the first episode, I thought to myself, oh, this is pretty interesting. I like it. And then the more I sat with myself, I went, this gives me anxiety. Yeah. I'm not, I'm yeah. just going to look it up. You, you <laughs> don't, you don't yeah. like, like, you had problems with Demon Slayer. Well, how you felt after each episode. Oh, I don't yeah, imagine yeah. how you felt I don't, with this. Yeah, yeah, because that one's tough. That's yeah. a toughie. Because it's like the situation's not great. Yeah, it, yeah, um, yeah. It, it is to me basically it's anxiety. The yeah. show. So I'm kind of just sure. like the first episode is definitely like because uh, at the end it's like oh this is not the way it's gonna go. Yeah, I was yeah. Like, hey. <laughs> oh this fucked up. Yeah, <laughs> plot twist. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it's a lot. Um, but then what else? Like, uh, I really I think one of my favorite animes is Mirai Nikki. Wait, oh, wait. interesting. I love Ooh, Future Diary. See, like, I, I was thinking, oh, I don't think Miles watched this one. And I'm going to nah, say it. Say it. Please watch Future Diary. Yes, Future Diary. Is that Future the one with the Yandere? Yes. Yeah. Oh, the, the titular. Yeah. The, yeah. the Pink uh, poster girl. child. Post- Pink hair girl, she like has a knife. Yeah, she has she has like this black dress, a knife. I mean, you have definitely seen it. Pink hair you've seen with her, yeah. ponytails. You, okay. you've There's definitely stuff seen about it. the show that you're going to love. Okay. Like, mm-hmm. yeah, it's 
Oh. Can I you feel- summarize it? Yeah. Ooh, uh, <laughs> it's been a minute, but it's just like guy phone god nice i'm, I'm just yeah. putting words nice. together nice. 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 nice phone god 12 phones what is it 12 or well, nine it's, it's tw- yeah 12 diaries it's 12 yeah diaries yeah, yeah those are the diaries okay right? that's what what i'm trying to like remember it's like um, death, i think it's that was like, very coherent yeah, yeah. Definitely yeah. Understand what the show's about. isn't that don't you want to watch it <laughs> so if, if, you, if you've heard the show <laughs> if, you, if you've seen it yeah. you know exactly, exactly. what's you going know exactly on exactly what's going on if you haven't then you're like I like this. I, I like Fiona explains. Yes. <laughs> she just gives yeah. us keywords. I give keywords and, and I'm like, you, okay. put, it you put it together. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys, I'm going to tell you all about Connoisseur through Rorschach ink blots. Yeah. <laughs> oh, did you see? <laughs> see what? The uh, screenwriter for Pulp Fiction. Oh my God. So I that the Konosuba movie, he would dare to say this is the reason that cinema was invented. Are Wait. you fucking kidding me? What? No, it's, it's I love that. Oh, it's a, it's a parody. I oh. love my assholes. I love my asshole. Konosuba, they're my assholes. Okay, wait, no, but you haven't this told me if that was real. It, yeah, it supposedly. Is. Yes. What? Hold crazy? on, I'll, let me Google what? it right now. It is the guy, who wrote, the guy who wrote Pulp Fiction, Kono I believe. Is this real? So, Quentin Tarantino. No, no, no. It someone is else. Avery something. Avery. Yep, Avery it's real. Is this real life? He gave it a five star, and then when somebody goes, "Oh my god," the guy who the screenwriter for Pulp Fiction gave uh, the Konosuba movie five stars, and he responded to that fan. Like uh-huh. he retweeted it and was like, uh, he was like, it was one of the most enjoyable cinema experience I've ever had. Dare I say the reason film was invented? Dare, oh, I, dare I say yep. that's crazy. Yep, it's super legit. Oh, and it's no, no longer in theaters. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> You'd have to watch all of Konosuba, though. So he's oh, watched all of Konosuba. Hell yeah, he dude. Has. He's a bro. <laughs> Damn, get it, Roger he's Avery. A yeah. Roger Avery, yeah. Yeah, he knows where the honey's at. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, yeah, that's fair. That's cool. Fair. Oh, yeah. That was vindicating. <laughs> yeah, that was... I was so excited. Cole, Cole has a lot of onions too. I love yeah. Konosuba. I know you do. It's very good. I, a, I need to finish it. Boy. There's too much shit. It's yes. so to watch. Much shit. Yes, don't so sleep. Much shit. Yeah, don't sleep. Don't, don't sleep. Do you watch anything Fiona? else? Oh no. <laughs> I just watch anime. I just watch it. <laughs> yeah, I wish I could. I just become a whiny bitch yeah. if I get less than like six hours of sleep. You're not wrong. I get it. Anything. I get it. I just become so. This way you eat a pizza every time you start your whiny. Eat a pizza. What I would give for your metabolism. It's gonna slow down and then I'm fucked. One day it's just gonna be like oh. You say that. I had a friend in college who like he was like if he was a meat he'd be beef jerky he was very lean and defined uh, and like he meat. would come home and eat sleeves of double stuffed oreos drink mountain dew that. that's Nesquay. like he was a monster and i was always like yeah well fucking one day yeah, yeah, yeah. One, one day he's, gonna, get- he's just gonna explode that son of a bitch <laughs> still looks like he did when he was fucking 19 years old meanwhile oh i'm just God. like Oh, what? Bless, bless from the gods. He's like me. He's not gonna gain any muscle though. What kind of meat are you, Fiona? <laughs> yeah, that is the most yeah, interesting that's a good question. Yeah. But that's a good. I was wondering how we get to this. I was like, this. I don't think we should have Miles tell us what all meats we <laughs> are. That, <laughs> seems, that seems a little weird. Are you the chicken fat? Ooh, <laughs> am I the chicken I'm fat? a little gristle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a, I'm a um, liver. Well, we'll, we'll think on this. Yeah. Good, hey, good in the comments below, what kind of meat do you think we are? Am I a lamb? Shop, who knows? Smash that like button if you like these meat related conversations. I think um, I'm spam. <laughs> oh, I'd be spamming a heartbeat. Yeah. I fucking love, I love spam. spam. Spam's dope. I love Fuck it. Yeah. Is this, an all, love is this it, a pro spam table? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Are we all, oh, yeah, are we're all, all pro spam. spam. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> da da da. Woo. <laughs> <laughs> That's the worst thing that happened. Yeah, yeah. Just end it. I fear the synergy yeah. at this table That's and what great. we're capable yeah. of. Pro we just just choose spam. Fuck me. Spam team. Spam. Fuck me. Attack for spam. Oh my god. Ooh. Some spam and some anime. Spam anime. Spam anime. Spam anime. Thanks for coming, Fiona. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for having yeah, me. We'll I definitely have like... to get you on again soon. Yeah, yeah, please bring me on. I don't speak. I can't talk about anime anywhere else other than here. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you yes. literally You're legally bind it. <laughs> literally, I can't. Like, I go to Achievement Hunter and I'm like, yo, this thing. And they're like, Jeff Ramsey's like, if I hear you yeah, fucking I, say, you fucking, one fucking, <laughs> fucking Gen you, Zer. You, you, <laughs> I'll fuck it. I oh swear to God. God. Take you out. Yeah, I'll take her out. I don't oh care what Obama said. Yeah. You take your manga and your anime and you get your the animus. fuck out. So get your animus out of here. Before the next time we have you on, is mm-hmm. there a show you want that we have homework for? 
Mirai? You need to watch Future Diary. Yeah. All right. Like, I okay. think that's the one thing. Out of all of the ones I said that you haven't watched, that's the one. Okay, we, For my spam ooh. sister, I will watch that. We will. Thank you. That can be, oh, that can be our first. <laughs> spam sisters. <laughs> <laughs> that could be our first, like, uh, book club slash thing we do eventually. Like, we'll give it some time and we'll let, we'll let the audience know. When. Yeah. Oh, yeah. To yeah. watch Future Diary. Do yeah. it. Do it. Do right. it. Do it. So, that's it. That's it. That's Done. It. Hey, that's hey all guys, did. show over. <laughs> show over. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I feel like the first week we did this show, we kind of had a, a sign-off line, and then we abandoned it, and I don't remember what it was. It was whatever. I don't need and one. And that's it the was... new. <laughs> no.